Impressing girls, especially the one you like, has become something of a rarity in this day and age. So if you want to increase your awesomeness to impress people around you, then the simplest answer is learn magic. A magic trick can be an excellent icebreaker for starting a conversation, especially with your crush. So be it the coin in a can trick or the rising up the ring trick. Hello and welcome back and today we'll unlock some of the simplest magic tricks that you can use to woo your friend. So let's get started. At number 7, Straw and String Trick. You can easily impress a girl by performing this cool trick. Just remember to take a string along with you and order a drink or two. Now, to perform the magic, take out the drinking straw and the string with the girl eagerly watching you. Put the string all the way through to the end of the drinking straw, making sure it goes in one side and comes out of the other. Then, fold the straw in half at its center. And with a knife or scissor, tell the girl to cut the straw through the middle. With the girl assuming she has cut the string in half, start performing the magic. First, show her the two pieces of the straw to prove that the slice has gone all the way through. And then, to the amusement of the girl, pull the string so that it comes out in one long piece. So, how did he do it? Well, here's the secret. Before the trick begins, the performer had already sliced the long slit on the straw carefully along its length. And this is the first secret. He hides the slit so that the girl never sees it. Now, after putting the string through the straw and bending it into two halves, he pulls hard on both ends of the string at the same time. This makes the string pop out through the slit, which he conceals by his fingers. Then, the straw is cut in half with the girl believing that the string too is cut along with it. However, the string is safe and sound below the scissor. Finally, with his finger covering the string, the performer stacks the straw carefully and pulls one end of the string as it easily slides out in one long piece, thus impressing the curious-looking girl. But I just cut it. At number 6, Coin Through Can Trick In this trick, you can see the famous magician Chris Angel performing a trick, where he takes a signed coin from a girl and inserts that coin through a sealed soda can. Then, to the amusement of that girl, he brings back her signed coin from the can. Ah, it's a pizza! <laughs> so, ready to learn this cool trick? Well, before revealing the secret, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get instant notifications of our new video uploads. Now, let's quickly get to the secret. First, the magician takes the signed coin in one hand, palmed up, and the can in the other hand. Here, the bottom of the can faces the coin. Now, with an impressive sleight of hand, he slams the coin into the bottom of the can. For this, he simply allows the coin to rest on the bottom rim, and shows to the girl that his hand is indeed empty. Next, he turns the can upright, making sure the coin is held between his palm and the can where he hides it from the audience. And seconds later, he makes a nice clink sound as if the coin has really penetrated the can. Now, you must be wondering, when did that signed coin go inside the can? For this part, he secretly manipulates the coin into his fingertips while he shows the sealed can to the girl. This is where the magician has that coin hidden behind his fingers. Now he moves on to break the seal. Here, the carbonated soda and his fingers provide the perfect foil as he drops the coin into the can. And that's the reason the audience don't see the coin drop through its opening and sinking into the bottom of the can. Finally, the magician pours the soda out as the excited girl waits in suspense for her coin to spill out. He stops just before it falls to make it even more dramatic. And then, to the amusement of the girl, he pours the coin and the girl gets back her quarter. I got my quarter! It's my quarter! At number 5, the rising ring trick. Magicians all over the world have been performing this awesome looking trick where, as you can see, the ring keeps on climbing along the string. The secret to this trick is quite simple and easy to understand. The string is actually a rubber band. In addition, you need a ring to go with it. Now, this trick almost works by itself. The rubber band does all the magic and you're the one who gets to impress the girl. 
First, cut the rubber band in length. You now have a long piece. Now, put a ring onto the rubber band, conceal half of it, and then stretch the band out. Make sure it doesn't break and keep most of the rubber band in your left hand. After stretching it out, you'll have a long, loose piece of that band dangling and hidden in your back palm. So this is the initial position. Both your thumbs should be at the same level so that the rubber band is horizontal. Also, make sure the back of your hands is pointing towards the audience so that they don't see this loose piece of the rubber band hanging out. Now, with the ring placed closer to the right hand fingers, slowly start releasing pressure off the loose piece in a steady manner to avoid any kind of jerking. This makes the ring to climb up the rubber band as if it were on an escalator, thus making the audience believe that this is indeed a great gravity-defying trick. At number 4, produce a card out of thin air. Have you ever seen a magician produce cards out of thin air? It's one of those tricks where the move is so cool that it looks so pleasing to the eye. And don't be fooled by the simplicity of this trick, it is very visual and can be a real deal breaker if you perfect it. The only thing you need is a pack of cards and a lot of practice day in, day out. Well, here's the secret. Place the card behind the hand on the back of your palm and gently open your first finger and little finger and then close it with a very slight bow on the card. This is the first position where your friend thinks that the hand is empty. Then close your hand and push your thumb onto the card as it sits on the nails of your middle and ring finger. Finally, slide your nails out so that you're holding the card with the pads of your middle and ring finger. You then pull off this trick by increasing your hand movements to show both sides of your hand without flashing the card. As you can see here, the magician performs this trick at a great speed and the height is such that it hides any flashes of the card moving from the back to the front and then back again thus making the card appear out of thin air. And this is what you too can perfect after enough practice. So did you like this trick? How would you impress a girl if given a pack of cards? Did it work out for you? Post your comments below and let us know all your secrets. At number 3, water into ice in a second. Can you turn water into ice in a second even without a deep freezer? No. But a magician can. Watch this carefully. The magician pours water in a cup and instantly turns it into a piece of ice. So how did he do it? Does he have a freezer in his hands? Now the secret here is quite simple to understand. The cup already contained a piece of ice in it and a sponge of the same color at the bottom of the cup. The water inside is absorbed by the sponge and what's left when the cup is turned upside down is the ice. The magic! Now, this can be a cool party trick to impress your friends during hangouts, isn't it? At number 2, Can on a Card Making a bottle or can stand on a card can drive any girl crazy. Oh my god! No. But for this to happen, you must know the secret behind it. We've all seen the great balancing acts shown by magicians on TV shows across the world, but this is a special one. Let's see how it's done. The magician takes a card and places a can on top of it. Then he does some magical acts of insanity, and there you have it. The can is standing on top of the card, but when you look at the back of the card, it's actually two cards stuck together and folded from their center. Now that forms a T-shape, which makes it easy for the can or a bottle to stand over a card. Now finally, moving on to the number one magic trick on our list, Pencil Through Dollar Bill. David Copperfield, the famous magician, once performed a trick in which he borrows a dollar bill from a spectator. Now, making sure that the pencil is pointing at the center of the bill, he pushes it through the bill as the pencil goes right through it, with the audience clearly noticing it. Then, he slides the pencil right through the center of the note, tearing it apart sideways. The audience even hears it when the note is being torn. He then shows the bill to the audience. Magically, the bill is completely unharmed, and the audience is totally impressed, especially the bill owner. So, how did Copperfield perform this cool trick? Well, here's the secret. And it's all hidden inside that magic pencil. Yes, the pencil used by Copperfield had a gimmick attached right over the pencil, and the color of that gimmick matched the pencil's color. The trick becomes easier to understand when the color of the gimmick differs from the color of the pencil. 
Here's how David performed the magic. He carefully places the gimmick over the dollar bill at its center, holding it behind his fingers. He then removes the pencil from the gimmick. At this very moment, he shows the center of the bill to the audience. Right here, the gimmick is held tightly against the dollar bill hidden behind his fingers. He then pushes the pencil through the gimmick, which makes the piercing sound, thus making the audience believe that the pencil has indeed gone through the bill. Then, he shows the pierced pencil to the audience to confirm it. Here, the part of the pencil facing the audience is actually a gimmick, as you can see here. Finally, he slides the pencil right through the center of the bill, with the audience believing it's ripping it off. Here as well, the gimmick plays its role to perfection, leaving the audience in tatters. But we all know it, the credit belongs to the gimmick, which these days sells on Amazon. Now it's quite easy to be a genius and impress anyone you want. So guys, these were some of the best magic tricks that you have learned to impress girls.